I knew that it would be very close based upon the early votes, which I'm sure were much heavier for me. Optimistic and seemingly unfazed. Democratic Congressman Tom Suozzi says despite his congressional race in New York's third district still being too close to call, where he trails by more than 4,000 votes, the seasoned politician sees a victory on the horizon, banking on 90,000 absentee ballots that have yet to be counted. Based upon the percentage of Democrats, the percentage of Republicans, the history of doing this kind of stuff that I'm going to win by over 20,000 votes. A bulk of those absentee ballots sent in by registered Democrats who opted to stay home due to the pandemic. An apparent trend that the congressman says happened across the country where in-person votes leaned Republican and mail-in votes leaned Democrat. Biden will win my district in Nassau County, and I will win my district in Nassau County. Last night alone, we swung a very large percentage of Democrats to vote for me. The congressman's Republican challenger, George Santos, a newcomer to the political scene, is singing a very different tune. He not only overlooked me, he looked down on me. He refused to debate me. The 32-year-old Queens native who works in finance said the congressman took an arrogant approach to the race and credits his current lead in the vote to an underestimated campaign which connected with voters. Our messaging was, I'm of the people and I'm running for the people. And uh, I think the congressman, the congressman was a little bit out of touch with reality and tone depth. 